Hi, Brian Sparks here, founder of Easiest Swinging Golf. Created especially for you seniors who've had a raw deal up to now being taught to swing like a tour player. Ours is a body friendly philosophy. I'm going to hit one or two shots for you, but before I do, I want to actually introduce you to this fantastic golf course behind me, which is Royal Ashdown Forest uh, near uh, East Grinstead in Sussex. A fabulous golf course, as natural a golf course as you'll ever get, great test of golf, but playable for all levels. No sand bunkers. So whatever your handicap is, you can't have that problem because there aren't any. There's heather and gorse and all sorts of other things which are uh, difficult in their own way. But as you can see, it's a beautiful place to come and play golf. So I've been fortunate enough that they've, uh, I've just spoken to Tim Cowley, uh, the club pro, and his brother Sam, and uh, they've been very kind and allowed me to come and do a little bit of filming. So I wanted to share that with you if you ever get the chance. If you've never played here and you're in the UK, get down here. If you're from abroad and you want to play some golf, you can come here and then you could play Walton Heath and Sunningdale and the Berkshire. Some wonderful, wonderful courses. You don't need to go to Scotland. They're great in Scotland, please don't get me wrong. Now, the shot I want to introduce you today is that little simple flop shot. I've got on, on an uphill lie, then it flattens a little bit, then there's quite a steep bank, which is probably a metre and a half up from the, um, from the fringe a short apron and then the pin is probably no more than five yards. A difficult shot and of course it's particularly difficult if you get a bit greedy. So let's see how we can play this shot and give you some tips that you would find practical. Now I've got a 56 degree, I could take a lob wedge um, but for me the 56 will do on this particular occasion particularly as I'm uphill. Now a very simple thing, I believe that the, the duty of we golfers in this particular shot is actually to move the club forward through the ball and we're tempted because it's uphill and because we want to stop the ball quickly we actually attempted to do this and try and flick it up and because that right shoulder goes down we tend to stub the club into the ground and it pops two or three yards in front of us and don't tell me you don't find that frustrating and because we're moving back the center of the swing is behind the ball so if we manage to miss the ground we're then coming up and we've turned the top it and it goes flying through the green. So one minute you're just in front of you, the next minute you're flying through the green and then you have to go over there and repeat the process. So you'll know if you followed my book and if you followed some of our videos, myself and some of my other coaches, you will know about a loose grip. Very important to stay relaxed on this shot. And then all I want to do is swing in a nice relaxed fashion and see if I can just keep moving forward through the ball. Just like that. And believe it or not, I've actually just finished short of the flag. A little bit to the left, but I've got about a six foot putt uphill. Because that's the other thing to take into account. You're better off going for a putt that's uphill than by being too precise and having a tricky downhill putt. So just moving forward through the ball, ball pops up in the air. And that one actually is stone dead. So I'm not looking for it to be stone dead. I'm looking at it to be at the pin or a little bit past it. But I think you'll see how I actually went right through the shot. Nice and soft, going through, nice and soft. And that one's actually two feet. So out of three shots, I'm probably gonna make par twice. And I've got a chance on the other one as well, because six foot is possible. Even if we tend to only hold, you know, top tour pros only hold one in, one in two, 50% success. So don't get worried if you miss a six foot putt, it's normal. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this uh, few minutes with me at the Royal Ashdown Golf Course uh, in Sussex. Get here, you will love it, especially if you're a purist of golf, they don't come any better than this. Thank you for watching and I hope that little tip, keep moving through, forward through the ball, will help you save some shots in your future rounds. Many thanks for watching.